Welcome, fans of Fate Grand Order. I am Avon, and you are watching FGO Tips. Today marks the beginning of the new challenge event in Fate Grand Order. In our last video, we talked about what to expect, so definitely check that out if you haven't already. But today, the event really begins, and I am celebrating by sharing roles from the banner that just expired, actually, because I am way behind schedule. The truth is, I actually recorded these on Sunday, but some things came up and I didn't actually have a chance to post them when I intended to, but you're not here for excuses, so without further ado, take it away me from four days ago! Welcome fans of Fate Grand Order, I am Avon, you are watching FGO Tips, and today I am doing just a couple of single pulls on the Caldea Boys Collection Pick Up Summon. I was actually prepared to skip this one entirely, but then Shiro said he would gladly fight by my side or something like that, and he gave me a summon ticket, so now I feel obligated to give him a shot. I'm saving my courts for the Counterfeit Spirits event next month, but I do have a few summon tickets saved up, so what the heck, let's give this a shot. Oh, and I purposely waited until Sunday, so I had a chance to pull Waver while I'm at it because I still haven't managed to do that yet either. Okay, 12 pulls, here we go. Really hoping for Shiro, Waver, or Salfo, but honestly not expecting them. Uh. Hide. Okay, um, actually I haven't reached NP5 yet with Hide, so that's not a terrible way to start. Honestly, I think I would be pretty satisfied if I got at least one of the limited time craft essences out of this. And speaking of which, wow, Salon de Marie, that is one of the three star limited time craft essences. Not a particularly exciting one, but it's cool just because limited time stuff is great for collections. That might be arguably the second worst out of all of them, but still pretty cool. Uh, let's keep going. And yeah, uh, I, I don't know how to make that one sound positive. Charm success rate up, meh. What's next? How about a 5 star? Nope, okay. Probably a, a 3 star Robin. Uh, well, at least 3 star servants can be sold for mana prisons, so that's not a complete loss. How about a 5 star? Nope, okay. Yeah, okay, that's about as exciting as it was the first time. Let's try something better. And what's it going to be? Another 3 star craft essence. I actually, I don't have enough of those for maximum loot breakthrough yet. Alright, we're halfway done, 6 more to go. What will it be? Oh, okay. So, I said Salon was probably the second worst. This is probably the worst out of all the new craft essences, but still a collector's item, and I actually, I love the art, the art on this one. is pretty great, so that's cool. I got two of the limited time craft essences. This wasn't a complete bust, if nothing else. Whoops, there you go. Might be the best art, though. All right, let's, let's, let's get something better now. Here we go. Ah, still isn't gold, but maybe it is Fergus. Okay, yep, that is going to get sold for more mana prisms. Let's go, something better. Four star or five star, maybe? Four star... Verdant Sound of Destruction is Buster Up, I think. That's not too bad. How about a Servant this time? What do you say? Ooh, okay, not a Servant, but that's not too bad. Five Star, Limited Time Craft Essence. Wasn't my top choice, actually, but 
it's it's really not a bad. I kind of dumped on this card in my last video when I was talking about which which of the craft essences to get. It's not a good like overall. It's only useful in certain situations, but in those certain situations, that that's not a bad card to have. All right, next up we have uh, another three star saber, Caesar. Yay! Selling that for mana prisms. All right, last card. What do you say? Shiro, Waver, maybe a Stalfo. Ah, it's still not gold. Uh, that's too bad. This is gonna be more mana prisms. Jill, yeah, okay, more, more mana prisms. All right, well, you know what? I, I can't complain. Three new craft essences, I should be happy. I was kind of torn about which one to get thinking about Teacher and I, and also, uh, the Noisy Obsession. I was hoping I would get one of those two and it would make up my mind for me, but you know what? I think, when in doubt, I am gonna go with the five star. I, I don't have a better reason at this point in time. I'm torn between the two, so here we go. And my battery is dying. Okay. I guess it's about time to wrap this up. Thanks for uh, being there while I failed my rolls again. It's really great to share this with everyone. Hope your rolls went better than mine. Good luck with this event. Good luck with the upcoming event. And uh, yeah, as always, thanks for watching.